Across the vast expanse of Eastern Europe and deep into Asia lies a land of unparalleled beauty and diversity. This is Russia, a country of snow-capped mountains, shimmering lakes, and vibrant cultures. Join us as we uncover the wonders of this captivating land. From the bustling streets of Moscow to the serene shores of Lake Baikal, we'll traverse diverse landscapes, each more captivating than the last. Prepare to be captivated by Russia's art, architecture, and natural wonders. Our journey begins in the heart of Russia, Moscow's Red Square. A place steeped in history, it has witnessed coronations and demonstrations. Towering above us are the colorful onion domes of St. Basil's Cathedral. We stand in the shadow of the Kremlin, the historic fortress. Nearby, we pay our respects at Lenin's mausoleum. No structure on earth compares to the spectacle of St. Basil's Cathedral. Nine chapels, each with a unique, vibrantly colored onion dome, spiral skyward. Legend says Ivan the Terrible, overwhelmed by its beauty, ordered the architect blinded to prevent any rival creation. We journey to St. Petersburg, Russia's window to the west and home to the Hermitage Museum. Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo, Rembrandt, Van Gogh, names resonate like a roll call of artistic giants. To wander these halls, to stand before such masterpieces, is to journey through human creativity. Just outside St. Petersburg, we find ourselves in a realm of opulence and grandeur. Often called the Russian Versailles, Peterhof is a celebration of extravagance, with cascading fountains, gilded statues, and manicured gardens. The piece de resistance is the Grand Cascade, a spectacle of over 150 fountains. Leaving behind Russia's cities, we venture to the heart of Siberia, to the shores of Lake Baikal. The oldest and deepest lake on Earth, Baikal holds one-fifth of the world's fresh water. In this realm of crystal-clear waters and snow-capped mountains, we encounter a unique ecosystem teeming with life. Embarking on the legendary Trans-Siberian Railway is to journey through the soul of Russia. From Moscow, we travel eastward, through vast forests, steppes, and mountains, witnessing changing landscapes and cultures. The rhythmic clatter of the train as we journey through time zones and cultures. On the serene waters of Lake Onega, in the heart of Karelia, lies Kiji Island, where faith and architecture intertwine in breathtaking harmony. We find the UNESCO-listed Kiji Pogost, a collection of wooden churches that defy time. The centerpiece is the Church of the Transfiguration, its 22 domes reaching towards the heavens. We return to the imperial grandeur of Catherine Palace in Sarskoye Selo. Built by Catherine the Great, the palace showcases her power and refined taste. In the far east of Russia, where the Pacific Ocean meets the Ring of Fire, lies the Kamchatka Peninsula, a land of volcanoes and untamed beauty. Amidst steaming hot springs and glaciers, we witness nature's raw power. Towering volcanoes, cloaked in snow and ice, their peaks shrouded in steam. On the shores of the Black Sea, nestled between the Caucasus Mountains and the sparkling waters, lies Sochi, where natural beauty and modern amenities meet. Once a summer retreat for Russian royalty, Sochi is now famous for its beaches, ski resorts, and vibrant cultural scene. We embark on a journey through the Golden Ring, ancient towns northeast of Moscow, each a testament to Russia's rich history. In Suzdal, we wander through cobbled streets lined with colorful wooden houses, showcasing intricate craftsmanship. In Vladimir, we stand in awe of the Golden Gate, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, a reminder of the city's former glory. We journey to the Caucasus Mountains, to the foot of Mount Elbrus, Europe's highest peak. A dormant volcano, its twin peaks capped in snow, challenge climbers and awe all who gaze. Intrepid climbers ascend the slopes, their progress slow, their determination a testament to the human spirit. We return to the Golden Ring, to the charming town of Suzdal, where time seems to have stood still. Local resident, we stroll through the Suzdal Kremlin, its whitewashed walls and onion domes reflected in the Kamenka River. Local resident, we visit the Museum of Wooden Architecture, where traditional wooden houses have been preserved, offering a glimpse into the past. On the banks of the Volkov River, we come to Novgorod, 
one of Russia's oldest and most significant cities. We explore the Novgorod Kremlin, its ancient walls whispering tales of battles fought and won. We marvel at the Cathedral of St. Sophia, its golden dome a beacon of faith for a millennium, and wander through Yaroslav's court, a trading center bustling with merchants from Europe and Asia. Back to the wilds of Kamchatka, we venture deep into the Kronotsky Nature Reserve, a UNESCO World Heritage Site and home to the Valley of Geysers. Geysers erupt in a symphony of steam, sending jets of boiling water high. The Valley of Geysers is a powerful reminder of the raw and untamed beauty of nature. Amidst breathtaking scenery, adventure awaits. We raft down raging rivers through canyons carved by glaciers millennia ago. Just outside Moscow, we find respite from the city's hustle at Kolomenskoye, a former royal estate offering a glimpse into Russia's imperial past. Amidst rolling hills and apple orchards, we discover tranquility and beauty. Marvel at the Church of the Ascension, a UNESCO World Heritage Site and architectural masterpiece. In the frigid waters of the White Sea lie the Solovetsky Islands, a remote archipelago with a captivating and tragic history. Amidst the stark northern beauty, faith and oppression have left their mark. The Solovetsky Monastery, a 15th century fortress, was a place of worship and a Soviet prison camp. At the confluence of the Volga and Oka rivers, we find Nizhny Novgorod, a city rich in history and culture. Known for its Kremlin and vibrant art scene, it offers stunning views of the Volga River. Nizhny Novgorod truly captivates the senses. In St. Petersburg, we marvel at Kazan Cathedral, inspired by St. Peter's Basilica in Rome. Its massive colonnade, soaring dome, and intricate sculptures create awe. Inside, we find shimmering gold, frescoes, and the scent of incense. We wander, marveling at the artistry and craftsmanship. We journey back to Karelia, to the shores of Lake Ladoga, the largest lake in Europe. Surrounded by forests and islands, Lake Ladoga is a paradise for nature lovers. We take a boat trip, marveling at the beauty of the forests and islands. Known for its Kremlin, mosques, and vibrant cultural scene, Kazan offers a unique perspective on Russia's diversity. We marvel at the Kul Sharif Mosque, its minarets a testament to the city's Islamic heritage. In the Southern Republic of Dagestan, nestled between the Caspian Sea and the Caucasus Mountains, lies Durbant, one of the oldest cities in Russia. Known as the Gateway to the East, Durbant has been a crossroads of cultures for centuries. We explore the ancient citadel of Narankala, a UNESCO World Heritage Site guarding the city for over 1,500 years. Our journey takes us to Kaliningrad, a Russian exclave on the Baltic Sea with a unique blend of Russian and European influences. Once the German city of Konigsberg, Kaliningrad is a city of contrasts, where medieval architecture stands alongside Soviet-era buildings. We visit the Konigsberg Cathedral, a brick Gothic masterpiece that survived World War II. Our final destination takes us back to the Caucasus Mountains, to Elbrus National Park, a high-altitude sanctuary dominated by Mount Elbrus. Amidst glaciers, alpine meadows, and crystal-clear rivers, we find breathtaking beauty. Hiking through pristine landscapes, the air thin and crisp, the silence broken by our footsteps in a distant waterfall. As our journey through Russia draws to a close, we are left with a profound appreciation for this land of contrasts. From bustling cities to remote wilderness, Russia is a country of immense beauty and rich history. Thank you for joining us. Until next time, keep exploring.